Moses Lake High School has another problem besides figuring out where to put all its students. Its track and tennis courts are falling apart. Patches designed to fill in trouble spots on the track have eroded and cracks have formed throughout the running surface. The tennis courts are in as bad of shape with cracks across the playing surface rendering one court unusable for the high school's team. Athletic Director Lauren Sandhop explained why full renovations are now essential. Both the Moses Lake High School track and the Moses Lake High School tennis courts were done, I want to say mid-90s, let's say 95. Um, so their lifespan t typically is about 15 to 20 years. And so we're, we're at that point right now where we're, we're 20 years in. And so we've got some cracks in some asphalt, which ultimately affects the playing surface. So as you look at those facilities, uh, you can see that the cushiony part of the track itself is getting compressed. And that's something that we need to address. That affects the kids' legs and shin splints and things like that. And community members come in and play tennis. Community members come in and use the track not to mention our, every one of our middle schools come and use our track for their meets. And so we really need to address that issue for multiple reasons. You know, not just for the athletic, the athletic director part of me where my teams are going out and playing on those facilities, but really our physical education classes and our community use those too. Sandob said the district is getting estimates for the renovations, but believes they could cost between $500,000 and $1 million. His hope is that if the district can find the money, the renovations would be done in time for the start of school in the fall. In Moses Lake, Devin Higgins for iFiber One News.